Hi, this is Girl Scouts of Northeast Ohio, and we are going to walk you through the renewal process for a lifetime member. Um, you'll go to girlscoutsofnortheastohio.org, and you can either sign in under the My Girl Scout, or you can find the Renew page by clicking Renew Now. Once you're on the Renew page, you can read some more information about renewal, but then you're going to want to click the green link that takes you to the renewal login. Once you get to the login screen, you're going to use your email address that is attached to all the communication you get from Girl Scouts of Northeast Ohio as your username. Your password, if you don't remember what your password is, you can use the forgot your password link. Once you do this, it'll send an email address um, to your email of, on file and it will give you a link to reset your password. I know my password. So I'm going to go ahead and log in. Once you log in, it takes you to your household uh, record. And I am going to go ahead and renew just myself for a role as a lifetime member. And what I'm going to do is you want to toggle to the next year. Um, if you have anyone else in your household that you don't want to renew at this time, you're going to mark them. I'll decide later. So we will deal with these renewals in, a, in another recording. Do not use, um, do not renew, because what that says is you are not going to renew them at all. They are no longer continuing in that position. So if you just want to hold off, you'll use the I decide later. If you want to say, I'm not coming back to that position, you use the do not renew. And the positions that you do want to renew, you'll select renew. Then I'm going to click on, so I'm going to renew this test leader to VTK test because it says it's time to renew. I'm going to click on continue. And for a lifetime member, that's really all the things that you need to do to actually renew the role. You can also at this time, which is a great time, go in and edit your profile details. So you can go ahead and update your address, um, update phone numbers, that kind of thing. So if you have anything that's new, this is a great time to check that information as well. And you would do that simply by clicking on edit under the correct person and you can edit their information. Thank you.